Hey guys, welcome back. Today I have a special treat for y'all. I'm going to be starting a new series in Ragnarok. As you can tell by the thumbnail. Um, I'm not going to stop my Aberration series. I'm going to be doing an Aberration episode. And then going and doing a Ragnarok episode. Earlier I did today's Aberration episode and now I'm starting Ragnarok. I'm, I'm going to be doing both series side by side. And um, yeah. So uh, yeah, let's get started. I'm going to spawn in the Highlands because there are horses there. There are advanced, the, the rock carrots and the Savarut grow there. So I'm going to be getting those. And uh, hopefully we get to see some Gigantosaur. Uh, not Giganotosaurus. Hopefully we get to see some Allosaurus. So yeah, let's go. Oh, great. Well, we're gonna have to deal with that. I don't know how the audio is gonna do. It's not... It's not going through, uh... Three wood. I changed a few settings. Um, I don't know if y'all noticed that closely, but there's a few things that changed. I am freezing over here. Why am I freezing? What? Yes, I'm actually freezing. It's zero degrees Celsius. It's 36 degrees Fahrenheit. Why am I... This... Um... Game? <laughs> Help? <laughs> I should- what? <laughs> okay, um, let's see if I can get some rock carrots before I die. This isn't good. <laughs> okay. Um... I died. I, I don't know how the sound is because it's not it's not going into my headphones so hopefully everything's okay, okay come on we might have to get up there hopefully we don't we don't see any gigas okay rock carrots so we got one we got three we got five pterodon all right. Yes, we need to get out of here. Okay. But we desperately need to get out of here. Okay. Ooh, there's a big tail. There's a big tail. Okay, it's a Bronto. This is not fair. <laughs> I did not expect to land here freezing to death. Literally. Okay, it's one degree Celsius. I need to change it to Fahrenheit. Okay. It's 35 degrees Fahrenheit here. 35. This is ridiculous. This should not be happening. <laughs> Alright. Well, this is a great way to start a new series off by dying on camera. Um... Yeah, just wow. It's still thirty six. Pterodons. See what you got. What levels? Sixty six. I'm sixty two. Which are great levels. Okay. Come on, pal. So, 
so, um, if I didn't know about these series, uh, not these series. about Ragnarok in the center um all the spawns are really high level spawns so um like everything is is like high level is it's it's, it's you, you, the things that spawn are mostly like really high level so it's uh it's great finding high level stuff here um which makes it great for great to breed things um, I know it's just it's interesting and Ragnarok has griffins they have um, boss battles that aren't like tech tier it's like like from the obelisks right there they have um you get really good like ascendant mastercraft uh, ramshackle stuff those really high those really good uh, things that you can get which is great so uh, white is level five Ooh, it's got it's a rare one so it's got it's got a ring around it wait I think the water is warmer than I am so this is gonna be yeah it'll be level 45 the water might be yes the water uh huh wow that's strange so if you're in like the shallow part you see what it says it says underwater but if you're above water you see I'm still underwater causeway of ancients is 39 degrees but underwater is 48 degrees at 12 degrees is the difference between me getting hyperthermia and me just being a little chilly I think that's 100% messed up so my dead body's over here um if I'm lucky I can go over there and get in the water until I don't know something great happens <laughs> um luckily for y'all I know the highlands a little bit better so I'm not gonna be wandering around that much trying to find out <laughs> where everything's at like I did the first time uh, I really started playing Ragnarok which was on the Xbox wow it's actually the temperature's going up it's at 40 now so before long it should be doing really well So, I need to turn this off ringer. Okay. Alright. So, we died three times. Um, this place is fairly easy starting out until a giga spawns. Or, an, or a pack of aloes spawn near you. Let's see. I think we can do with some silk see if we can get some more silk because if you didn't know Ragnarok Ragnarok um, you can get scorched earth stuff here too it's like it's a place where you or it's like part of the map is actually like desert like full-on like scorched earth desert see it's 41 degrees it's ridiculous so actually if I can get in the water it should be good I really shouldn't be eating the rock carrots save them for the horses but I don't know if I ever like really if I can get in the water I, I'll uh, be able to heal up Actually, I need to find a rock too. It's right here. So yeah, I've got a few plans. I uh, yeah, here we go. So now my health should be going back up. Yeah. 
Yay. I'm not dying. <laughs> 51 degrees. Oh, it's 51 degrees in here. Let's see what happens when you get out. 42. Okay. So yeah, we're probably just gonna have to stay in here for a little while, and then I'm gonna go out and uh to the top part over here and go exploring a little bit. The sooner I can get crystal, the happier I'll be. <laughs> Let's see. Let's get out the basics. Like I said, I don't get those. I'm gonna need this eventually. So yeah, um something else I can get. I wonder if I can get these. No, I can't get them yet. Alright. Let's see. Yep, still freezing. And actually I have this now. Sweet, okay. So we can actually go around right here. Start attacking things. So, um, for y'all who haven't played in Ragnarok, this place is huge. Like, it's not... It's not as, um... Like, horizontally and, uh... Like, this place is huge, like, square, uh... Feet, square meters. Kilometers. Um... It's like, it's such... It's a big place. Unlike Aberration... Which is big, but it's like aberration. Ooh, yay! So 44 degrees is when you start freezing um, without any without any protection. Yeah. So um, no, I want to get get some. Uh, it's like okay, so aberration. It's big, but it's big in the respect that you have a. Uh, like it's it's a, it's a lot more vertical. It's like there's stuff up and there's stuff down, but here there's just it's like big horizontal like <laughs> it's just it's big like square meters. Like there's a, there's a large area. Okay, hopefully we don't have any gigas in our way. Is that a moss chops? That's a moss chops. I don't have any bee honey. I didn't have any last time, so let's see. Do I have to be a certain level? Giant bee honey. Great. There's no uh, giant bee stuff on this side of the map. Even though the redwoods are right there. That's where you can get the set for redwoods. But you don't actually get beehive stuff. Until you get uh, ways over there. So yeah, right now it's just a race to 10. And then I can start um, getting horses. Which are a little bit OP. But actually getting horses early on is like really good. Because. They have a. Th their saddle. You don't need a saddle to ride them. But if you get a saddle. You get a little bit of armor. And it's like a. Uh, it's like a mortar and pestle. It is a mortar and pestle. So, you, so it's like a. Uh, a moving mortar and pestle. I mean, obviously you could have one if you have a platform saddle, but I don't. Um, it's a fast <laughs> mortar and pestle. <laughs> okay, so I gotta watch out because gigas spawn everywhere, and so do aloes. And but they're actually both faster than me. But you can see giga much farther away than an aloe. I just hope I don't die up here. But uh, this landscape is huge. This the Highlands part. Half of it is like actually has Scotland in the name, which I think is really cool because I've never been to Great Britain. Okay, and they're actually pretty scary. <laughs> just hearing aloes is just tranquilizing. Okay, so we got some savroot up here. Three, five. Okay. Put it in the five slot. So one, two, three, four. 
should be enough to get to like 80. So I'm going to start walking everywhere now. I'll probably go over there. But I don't need to go over there until I'm about level 10. So, um, I've never actually tamed a galley. Gallimimus. I've never tamed one. It's crazy. So the good thing about this place is that there's stones everywhere. Like when I when I'm uh, when I don't when I spawn in and I don't have a stone to to get stuff with to start out with, I'm always thinking like they need to um, add some kind of mod or something where you spawn with a stone, and it's like uh, like a complimentary starter stone, so you don't have to go around looking for stone for hours. I, I thought about that. Okay, sav root, sav, sav. I got some rock carrots. So, um, on the Xbox, I tamed the Giga, but it was actually like trapped in the um in the trench over there. If y'all if y'all know where I'm talking about, in that trench up there, it was trapped in the trench. And what's crazy is all I did was uh. Like I just um, I put a metal gate down. For some reason, it decided it was such a great idea to attack the gate. Just the gate. For some reason, I thought it was it was a genius. And then I uh, I kept shooting it with crossbows and from from the top. And then I hopped down. I think I I was riding a horse, so I just hopped down on the horse. And it seemed to be just fine. Oh yeah, I forgot that it's the um you can't I can't hear it on here. So yeah, I'm gonna get some I'm gonna go in there. Hopefully I can get two crystals because crystals would really help right now. Well I don't have the Ingram Fort, but eventually I will and it'll probably be so helpful. Okay. So this is actually called Okay, when I get in here. I'm still, I guess this isn't like, wait, isn't there an artifact in the other one? I see stone, 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 stone. Come on, give me a crystal. <laughs> Two crystals. And I guess this is fine since I don't have a metal pickaxe. But eventually, I'm going to need a metal pickaxe. So I don't know. Okay, so no crystals. Probably not gonna be seeing crystals for a really long time in here now. But um let's see. Okay. So the knights are gonna be treacherous here. Let's see. Gallimimus. Hey, how's it going, bud? 24. Things are so fast. 174. I gotta keep that in mind. Yeah, I've never gotten a Gallimimus. Mostly because when I try to tame things, they, uh, I use a crossbow. I just like a crossbow better. And, uh, you can't tame... A Gallimimus with a crossbow, it does too, way too much damage, and Gallimimus are weak and fragile. Super fast, just weak and fragile. So how much is a whip? Whip is all the way down here, yeah? A whip would be awesome right now. Let's see clay, preserving salts, slingshot. I don't see a whip. It's at 20. Yeah, that's fine. I'll just collect silk until then. I've actually only been in this little cave a few times. The only reason with that being that is um so the the other crystal cave originally on the xbox I had it set up 
it was like uh, the normal uh, respawn rates or something like that. And so like it would respawn really slow and if it's and that Giga from the Xbox hung out right here, like this part right here that I'm looking at right there, right there. It only like it traveled up in here, and uh, I don't think it ever got anywhere n near that little uh, the bridge. And so right here, I would look for the crystal, and like I couldn't get to it because of the Giga. And the Giga, I got so much to say about the Giga. One of them being that they need to increase the rewards from killing one. Cause that sucker's hard to kill. <laughs> For y'all uh, out there, yeah, it's so hard to kill. Isn't there an artifact in here? I think there's an artifact in here. Give me some mm. crystal. So this one, I think, is the one that has the cool name. Nope. Okay, I and mean, that's fine. This thing's already 21 minutes long. I might... I could pop out a few episodes of this. <laughs> I could talk on and on and uh... For right now, this early on. I thought there was a... Artifact in here. Let's see. Oh well. Come on. Oh wait. Yeah, I have to go all the way down, don't I? No, I don't. Okay, meanie. It's <laughs> a little bit of water. Okay. Okay, I should have been collecting stuff and making a little bit of stuff. So this actually, I should have some, um, insulation, yeah, because you have that home icon right here. So there's, you get insulation from actually being somewhere where it's, like, enclosed. Okay. Yeah, you get, you get, um, temperature, um... You get you get t temperature insulation from being somewhere where it's enclosed. There's a pack of aloes right there. That is so scary. Ooh. Goodness. Hope they don't. I hope something doesn't. They don't. Okay. That's so scary. Just seeing aloes. Cause um, one of my first times playing. That, that time I told you about the Giga, that was like, I had like a whole, um, few weeks of playing this. I got a 180 Lightning River and etc, etc. It was awesome. And so, yeah. <laughs> I actually lived in a Megalosaurus cave because it, the Xbox kept glitching out. Like, I couldn't actually, like, get out of the cave. It would glitch up and then I have to go collect my Megalosaurus again. I thought that was a Giga, but yeah, <laughs> I want to go back up here. So yeah, um, I guess this concludes episode one. Thanks for watching. If you liked it, please hit the like uh, uh hit the like button. Please subscribe and turn on the bell icon. Um, I'll see y'all next time. Alright, bye.